Welcome to Talk of the Town. I'm your host, Carrie Dillon. We're joined by Debbie Kilgore, and we're talking about Hazel Deans today. This is one of those fabulous local stories of success and survival and timing that you all have just opened a fabulous uh, gourmet grocery store. I almost said luxury, but gourmet grocery store right next to the shops at Sea Pines, that freestanding unit that was a bank. Congratulations. Thank you so much. We're excited to be here. So you kind of planned to open this week or, or you know during during the heritage you plan to already sort of have had a soft opening um, in time for heritage yes we were hoping originally to be open for the heritage yeah. because we know what that brings to sea pines and the hilton head community but traffic um, but in mid-march we were stopped with the uh, covid19 so we decided to take our time and really get things right and then we had our soft opening two weeks ago yesterday what a blessing to be able to like just take your foot off the accelerator yeah you know be where you are with this and then use it to your advantage now did the you guys did a whole build out it, it, it did that get interrupted at all with the with the N pandemic no because it was just us doing it mostly um there were the shops of sea pine center is an amazing uh, place to be. Yeah. They really support us and take care of us. So there was a lot of things that they had to do and we were doing at the same time. So it, it was nice. It, it really worked out well. We transitioned it from a bank to a gourmet grocery market. That's cool. That's so cool. Now, were there any elements of design that were bankish that you integrated into the grocery? store? Yes, actually. There is a really heavy glass uh, counter, I guess, that had the little pockets yeah. where you would have your deposit slips. Sure. And so right, we, right at your check sign. Yeah. Bit. yeah. Yeah. So we left that there. And in front of it, we have our checkout. Oh, that's cool. And then where the teller were set up behind that, there's a counter where they had all the drawers and little safes. Yeah. So we left that there. Oh, that's so cool. And um, the drive through is our office. And the best thing is the vault. Yeah. The vault is there, and it, but it's now filled with wine instead of cash. That's so cool. That's yeah. so cool it's to really nice. use that space as is. You know, there's um, a couple of places like that. The Savannah College of Art and Design has their tea house. It was an apothecary, you know, and a restaurant down there that's called Vault that yeah. uses the bank. So oh, I I've love that. when you use those elements. Okay, so you all have your own brand of your own products. Tell us a little bit about what we can find there, what your hours are. If you do online stuff, just give us the rundown. Sure. We don't do online as of yet. Um, our, our private label products are jellies, uh, uh, preserves, marmalades, things like that. Syrup we right have there, butter pecan syrup. Butter pecan syrup as well as a blueberry syrup that is just great on pancakes or waffles or biscuits like people like to do. Yeah. Um, so that's our that's our um, name items. Um, you, what's then, Hazel Dean's? What's that, that whole namesake? Okay, so Hazel Dean was my husband's aunt, my mother-in-law's sister, and she lived in a small town in Alabama called Tallahassee, which is right in between Auburn and Montgomery. And being from Atlanta, we would go visit her quite often, and my husband was a good cook and liked to experiment with different things, and she was very supportive of us, and she like encouraged us to do different things. She would call the neighbors when we were when she knew we were coming, and, yeah. and all of a sudden there'd be 20 people there oh for dinner, oh and, my gosh. and we we loved it. And she, and so this is an homage to her. I love it, and it has such a ring to it. Yeah. You know, isn't it wonderful when there's somebody whose life you know, becomes the the label of something, their life and their inspiration. You can feel it in their name. It's I, I get that. I totally get that from Hazel Dean's, and I love the design, the label design, and um, the colors. I mean, it's just it's very um, it's it's very organic and very classy. I just love it. So, what what, what can you. you expect to find? Walk us in. Walk us through the product of uh, paint a picture of when you walk in the door. And what so, happens. when you walk into the in the door, you're going to see the old bank building, and it's mostly the same. To the right is a big open space, and we have um, we have merchandise set up there. But there was a fireplace there that we left there, and we sort of have a living room kind of little built in there. And eventually, when it's safe to do, we'll have gatherings there. Um, and then where the tellers were, we have deli. Deli okay, coolers. Okay, so deli, um, deli products. Deli fabulous. products, smoked meats and sausages, hanging salamis, 
and we have fresh hand cut steaks. Wow. That uh, you can't find here anywhere else on the island. That's fabulous. So you have wine selection. What about pastas, spices? We have uh, pasta. We don't have spices, uh, but we have pasta. We have I don't know, refrigerated pasta, uh, like raviolis and stuff like that, as well as dry pasta from Italy. Wow. And most of our products that were locally sourced and locally made, like the Geechee Boy, Carolina Gold Rice, and the Just Grits, uh, the grits from the Gullah, Yes. Gala Gourmet. Oh my gosh. Their product is amazing. Yeah. And uh, we love to carry that. And then uh, Big Spoon is also a regional thing. We have Nightingale ice cream from Vermont. Oh my gosh. No, not Vermont, I've Virginia. Been... It... Okay. That people just love. They come in and they were like, oh, Nightingale, we know that. <laughs> is that right? Yeah. So uh, so it's exciting. We have all, all, all kinds of different gourmet items, but we also carry beer. Um, but just regional craft beers. Gotcha. Um, now, what about uh, any grocery type items? Like, can you grab milk, eggs, that kind of stuff? Bacon? Not yet. Or is it, we're no, working gotcha. on that. Gotcha. We're having a challenge because we're so small. Sure. And so, space. I mean, you know. But we have the... breads from Pepperidge Farm. Oh breads is the only ones we're going to be carrying right gotcha. now because they're double wrapped. It makes it stay fresher longer, especially perfect. here on the beach. Uh, it's a perfect time to get out there and just schnauze around a little bit, pop yeah. in, and, and see good, fabulous stuff. Well, welcome. We're so happy to have Thank you here. You. Hazel Dean in the right next to the shops at Sea Pines. Come check them out. It's so good to be with you, Debbie. Thank you. We'll Thank be right you. back with more Talk of the Town.